and Parks Bistro and Bar specializes from scratch new American cuisine, and they are celebrating four years with an anniversary and Kentucky Derby party. Here in our Studio 41 kitchen with the preview is owner Steve Salami. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. You've had a good four-year run. It's time to celebrate, and it happens to happen right around the Kentucky Derby. So That's right. Good well, marrying of things. Thank you. Yes, we are doing that in May 6th, uh -huh. and it's going to coincide with the Kentucky Derby, so we're doing specials for Kentucky Derby, too, like the hot brown sandwich and the mint tulips yeah. Yeah, and um, many other things that go with uh, with uh, uh, Kentucky Derby. So it'll be fun. Fun. But now you're making for us chicken milanese. I guess this is one of your popular springtime dishes? Yes. Actually, we do a special every month, and we chose this one for the coming month okay, okay. because it's spring yeah. even the year. So that's a, a chicken milanese. Okay. And it's made fresh right here. Okay, uh, tell us how yeah. you go about making this. Okay, so we have the chicken that we marinated over uh, night usually, seasoned and everything. And okay, we, first we drench it in some flour. Okay. So you actually took a breast and you filleted it and then you... Yeah, we butterfly it, fillet it, it, bound it a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, so it's kind of consistent cool. and, mm -hmm. uh, you know... Some of the spices side. too. You need, you need the flour because otherwise the eggs will not... Okay, so Stick you're gonna, to it, okay. so we do gotcha. it, then we put it in the egg. And there's some seasoning in that egg? Yeah, okay. yeah so there's seasoning in every the one of those. Okay, I'll say, I smell it in every in step. The, mm -hmm. Yeah, and then you want to give it a little crunch. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, and then you're going to put it back in here? Or in no. breadcrumbs? That's oh, you got to put it in the crumbs. Oh, yes. oh yes. look at this. This is fun. Yeah, yeah this is a... Uh, a double dip kind of a situation yeah. going on here. You want the the, the crispness uh, for the chicken. It's going to be nice inside, oh, juicy. Oh, very and it's nice. The breadcrumbs in there. It almost yeah. reminds me of a schnitzel a little bit. Yeah, it's the Italian version of yeah, schnitzel, right. really. Yes. So, new American cuisine, what exactly is that? Well, new American is takes a little bit of everything. It's the modern take of an American food. Okay. Plus, kind of infuse it a little bit with all kinds of food. And this is why we are a bistro. Okay. Yeah, okay. Because we want the freedom to be able to include Italian, uh, Greek, uh, Middle Eastern, mm -hmm. and American, of course. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we, we, have, we use that in all uh, brunch, uh, happy hour and dinner for mm -hmm. brunch. We do uh, shakshuka, shakshuka today. Shakshuka, yeah. yeah. Shakshuka is a North African mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. meal where the eggs are simmered in a hot sauce that's been in a hot tomato sauce that's been simmering for hours. Yeah, yeah I like that. Yeah. Nice vegetables and such. Yeah. Yes. And that is then, a big pork chop too. Yes, we have also our beignets. Oh, oh yeah. And also we have for dinner we do um, a bunch of homemade appetizers, uh, sandwiches, and salads. And of course, entrees, and we chose the pork chop tonight, today. Oh, okay. Sorry. That is a huge, that is a pork, huge chop. pork chop. Yes. And then we have the happy hour. We have happy hour uh, every day, uh, Wednesday through thir uh, Saturday. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we feature all kinds of specials with craft cocktails, beers, and such, and uh, appetizers. And one of them is the chicken wings right there. Yeah, I like how you have the, uh, the, the Cubs margarita. Yes, the blue we, are, we, we do have, uh, we are in uh, about 14, 15 minutes away from uh, uh, Wrigley Field. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we do celebrate the Cubs games Love and it. we have specials usually on, on those Yeah, days. so you say you're close to Wrigley Field, that means you're over in Lakeview on that Southport corridor there. Yeah, we're Southport and Irving Park. Perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, Perfect. so your chicken is cooking. How long does that take about to cook? Well, fifth, less than fifth, five minutes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, because you pounded <coughs> it. You just want to give it a little crust. Okay. And okay. then uh, basically we're gonna turn it over once it's ready. Okay. And then we actually, uh, by the magic of television, have one of the. We finished. have one ready just yeah. in case. Okay. <laughs> and yeah. So once we have it finished, what, what's next? Then we're gonna dress it. Okay. And okay. serve it, okay. and we can actually do that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, if you wanna so. leave it on there, then I can just keep an eye on it for you. If yeah. You want. Oh, thank I'll, you. I'll, thank I'll you for your help. You know, yeah. Uh, anything I can do to help you out. <laughs> thank you. Thank okay. you. So, so we, we basically serve it with a salad. Okay. Okay. And uh, 
some garnish. Mm -hmm. Okay, the garnish we have it ready. It's basically uh, some greens and tomatoes and relish mm. uh, in in a dressing. Oh, okay. So now, do you serve it like that, or do we have to mix it up ourselves? No, so we. This is ready, but we're gonna mix the salad. Okay. Now. Okay. And the salad basically is some virgin olive oil. Mm. Uh, we have uh, a little white vinegar, wine white vinegar. Nice. We have lemon juice. It's all natural things. Yeah. We basically. have a little salt, of course. And then we have za'atar. Oh, what is that? This is our ingredients. Za'atar is a Middle Eastern um, uh, seasoning that okay. they use to put on everything. Mm -hmm. So we decided why not make our dressing a little unique. Okay. And we put it in the dressing. Give it a little yeah. cut. Yeah. And then we just toss it. Okay. Usually. And we take the salad. Okay. Well done. That looks good. That looks good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Steve, yeah. thank you for joining us. Park and Port Bistro and Bar, as we mentioned, it's over in Lakeview on the Southport Corridor. There's the social media handles as well as the website, portandparkchicago.com. Check them out. You can have a big celebration mm -hmm. on sa um, Saturday, May 6th for the That's fourth right. anniversary of the restaurant and Park. Kentucky Derby, huh? That is right. So make yeah. sure you go get Thank your mint julep. I love a good beignet. Oh,